Hello everyone, so if you've been doing your dailies every single day ever since we got the solar energies, you'll notice that we're heading at around 120 solar energies. So if we look at the Dragon Express over here, you can see that at 125 solar energies, we can buy our soul badge. So I'm going to cover what the Fire Gunner should get first, because I play a Fire Gunner on the NA server. So there are two choices for the Fire Gunner. The first choice is the Primal Force Soul Badge. This basically gives you two extra seconds when you use your tab skill or tombstone. The second choice is the Holy Fire Soul Badge. Every time you do a successful unload, which is like your F key, or, or what we call burst bullets in the Chinese server, you will get a three second buff. It's called the Torch Effect. So every time you use one of these burst bullets, you get three seconds of increased chance of detect weakness, or what they call triple shot on the NA server. So basically, it just makes sure that you activate triple shot a lot more than usual. I, I don't have a calculation of the percentage, but it activates a lot more. So for example, at the moment, when I shoot 40 focus, if I just keep shooting all the way down, usually I will get detect weakness maybe once, maybe twice if I'm lucky. But if you have the, the badge, you detect maybe four to five times on average, which is quite a huge increase in detect weakness. So that's why you want to go, that's why you might want to think about going Holy Fire. So how do you make a decision between going Primal or Holy Fire? It's quite simple. When you come to the training dummy over here or just practice in F12, press Tab and press F, Reload, F, Reload, F, Reload, and F and see how many times you can pull it off. If you're like me and you can only pull off four rotations, then go Holy Fire. If you can pull off five rotations because your ping is low enough, then go Primal. The main reason is because that two seconds increase for Primal is going to let you pull six, possibly seven rotations. However, if your ping is really high, like mine, then it's going to take, uh, even with the Primal Soul Badge, you're only going to be able to do five rotations maximum which really, there's no real point in doing that because other people with lower ping can pull off five rotations normally. So that's that's the main argument there. Okay, so let's talk about Shadow Gunner now. So Shadow Gunner also has two choices. The first choice would be the Magnum. The Magnum Soul Badge is the first choice, which increases Dark Mark effect for four seconds. So Dark Mark basically just gives you increased damage to that specific target, and increasing the duration by four seconds gives you more damage on bosses, especially since they have a lot more health and they take a lot longer to kill. So since the Shadow build is all about consistent damage, by having that extra multiplier on it, it helps a lot. So that's choice number one. The second choice is the Eternity Soul Badge, which gives you three seconds of uh, no chi cost for whenever you use your sea skill or moonshine. So this is also very strong. And the best part about it is that they can be fused together. So after you get your Magnum Soul Badge and your Eternity Soul Badge, you can fuse them together and make the Arcana Soul Badge, which is a legendary one, but it gives you both effects. So this is why you want to go Magnum and then Eternity, or Eternity and then Magnum, depending on what you what you prioritize more. And then at the end, you want to fuse them together, and then you get one Soul Badge, which is perfect. For the Fire Gunner, unfortunately, this cannot be done because the Fire Gunner, to they don't have anything that's actually useful to be fused. The Primal cannot be fused with the Holy Fire, so it kind of sucks. However, with the new 55 patch coming around the corner, uh, there there are going to be new soul badges. So I would hold on to either Primal or Holy Fire, depending on your ping, and just wait until the new soul badges come out. Then there'll be new fuses. That way you can get, you know, you can upgrade your, your soul badge then. And it's not that long of a wait anyway. You need to save up uh, your solar energies after you get your, your first one anyhow. So there's no rush to get them. Okay, so that covers the gunner. So I know that every, most people are going to be getting their solar energies there to 125 within the next two days. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get mine in two days since you get four day. If you get lucky and you get, and you get a crit, I might be able to get mine tomorrow, which will be awesome. But yeah, uh... That's about it for the video. Anyway, I hope to help. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. What can I say except you're welcome for the heals, the boosts, so.